Hello YouTube, this is Cupellism here and today I'm showing you my Italian ultimate team. Dun dun dun. Alright, goalkeeper, Buffon obviously, he's just an arc and he's a really good keeper. But some people don't like him, so fun is. Um Oh, actually. Yeah yeah, well we got Ogbonna at the back with Cellini. Cellini probably cost the most out of this team. Um I don't know, how much did he cost me is have a look. Oh, 7,500 which is pretty cheap. I remember I got him in a pack and sold him for 14k. Um, a bate right back. Oh, he's just so fast. I love him. He catches up easily with anyone pretty much that's just running down the ring. Well, from the games I've played with him, he has. Um, Bowser out here. He's pretty fast left back. I mean, he likes to push up a bit. I mean, stats are pretty decent. I mean, shooting is a bit terrible under Bate. His stats are pretty decent as well. Um, same with like our two centre backs. Well, I don't know. Ogbonna isn't the best, like, coming to most of his stats, but I do have Nesta as well, which I was saying in a minute. Like, centre defensive mid, so we have De Rossi and Perlo. Perlo has scored some amazing long shots for me. I don't know why his shooting's only 74. Um, decent passing and dribbling. I mean, look at Perlo's pace though, it's a bit of a letdown, but I suppose he doesn't really need to be that pacey. Um, De Rossi's stats are all above 70, look, he's just an all-round good player. Centre defensive mid as well, he's got right formation for me. Um, centre attacking mid, so we've got Giovanni and Kosu, I'm, I believe, I don't know. Look, Giovanni's 91 pace, which is really good for like running down the wings. Um, but shooting, not the best, I mean, I really leave the shooting to my strikers, to be honest. Passing, you know, it's pretty good. Um, both of them. Look, look at it. They both have really good dribbling. So for pushing forward, you got pace and dribbling for pushing forward on both of them. Really, so it's pretty good. Um, defending and heading, pretty rubbish, terrible on both of them. Um, our right, strikers, we have Mikkeli and Di Natale. I have a um, plus ten card on Di Natale because I don't, I don't actually play online with these teams. I just play my friends. So like use one card and it doesn't get rid of it after you play your friend so I used a plus 10 card and look at his stats oh my gosh they're just amazing but yeah um so basically just minus 10 from all of the Natali stats really um they're both fast they, they both got good shooting as well like the what 86 and 80 well they both got 86 pace though um 84 and 85 shooting that's like really good for two I, I've never really had two good strikers that are good at shooting um Di Natale's passing, 81, slightly better than Mikkeli. Um I don't know, Mikkeli has a really good finesse shot. Um, 85 and 87 dribbling, that's both good as well for pushing forward. Um, I think they both have four star skills. They've, I'm not too sure that, I, but yeah, well, if you know, then you know, but I don't. Um, we have three, um, well, I didn't actually complete this team because I just wanted to get rid of it, really. I just want, I wanted to make a new team. I got, I've had this team for a few days and I well it's a really good team to play with I really love playing with it but I didn't really I just want to make a new team really um Nesta our um our other defender I mean his stats aren't the best for he's 85 and his stats really do not show that I mean he's got 83 defense but other than that is and 78 headings alright but for an 85 is I don't know it's just weird um Marchisa he's a really good midfielder I mean his stats are pretty much all above 70 as well other than his head in. He's a good midfielder. He's like a lot better than it says on there, I reckon. And Mario Balotelli, what a boss! He, who does? Who wouldn't have Mario Balotelli in a um, Italian team? To be honest, I know. Uh, and I just got some like other players from my other teams just to fill places. Yeah. Chabalala. Anyway. Um. Right. Oh yeah, and I got Mancini. The um. Obviously, if you're get, picking an Italian manager, you're going to want him or Fabio Capello, so... I don't know. He was a lot cheaper than... And he was in the right formation, so I thought I'd buy him. I, I, much, I can't see how much I'm going for. Um, yeah, well, thanks for watching. This has been Cupidism. Thank you. Goodbye.